guys, it's Brittany from Coffee Planner Mom and I'm here today planning in my mini happy planner for the week of October 28th through November 3rd. So Halloween falls this week and I'm definitely going to be decorating for it. I'm going to be using the mini seasonal wrong wrong sticker book. Um, so this is going to match my classic spread. I don't always do a matching theme in both of my planners, but because it's a holiday and I have a seasonal sticker book, I figured I'm going to go ahead and do it. Now, I wanna to try to make this look kind of different. Like I don't want to make it look identical to what my classic looked like. So I actually have it opened and off, bleh, open and off to the side so that I can reference it and try to save my stickers. So part of the reason why I want to do this is a lot of the stickers in here are pretty comparable to the stickers in the other sticker book. And I kind of want to save some stickers that I still have like the whole collection basically. So that is what's going on here. Now I use this planner as an on the go planner. So I keep track of places I need to go um, shopping lists for things that I need to pick up when I'm out and about and stuff like that. So I am going to start off by using, hmm, I don't know, I might only need one checklist. So, okay, we'll do the shopping list last actually because I'm not sure where I'm going to want to put it and then how big is it okay so it will leave this so yeah I might end up putting it down in the notes so we will see we will see so the first thing I'm going to do we do have somewhere that we need to go on Friday so I will stick it right over here so it's not covering up where it says the first I like to try to do that and then I'm going to take oh no I don't know if I want to take the matching orange um I'm going to take this box sticker with the jack-o-lantern though and use it down over here on Thursday to mark off trick-or-treating um we live in Pennsylvania and township to township it varies depend like what day you will trick-or-treat and luckily for us we trick-or-treat on Halloween itself so that is really exciting. This is bothering me, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to cover it. So we'll just try to deal with it and see how well that goes. Now, I have two places to go on Tuesday, nowhere to go on Monday. And by nowhere to go, I don't mean like, oh, it's open for, no, like we cannot go anywhere on Monday because that is when we are carving our pumpkins. Um, really excited. Can't wait to do that. What am I looking for? Oh yeah, something like a box. All right. Well, I have the accessory book. Let's see if there was any other Halloween specific boxes in here that I could use. I'm trying not to necessarily use, this one I might use because it has the black. Um, I'm trying not to use things that are like fall specific. Oh, I could use her. I think I might use that one. Oh, okay, well, hold on. Here's one that has a little pumpkin. Okay, so let's see. I think I'm going to use the, whoa. All right, washi running everywhere. Um, I'm going to use the pumpkin one on Tuesday. And that is going to be to mark off my kids' events, like their lessons. So we have golf. No, we don't have golf. We have guitar and gymnastics. Everything that they're in, the girls, it all starts with G. I cannot ever keep it straight. So yeah, there's that. Um, I need to mark something, two things off on Sunday. Let's see. I do like this little later triangle. So I'm going to use that. And 
Ooh, there is a little, a girl wearing, yeah, that says Halloween. So I'm going to put that right there with that box, because like I said, that one is to mark off trick-or-treating. Um, but anyway, I need two things for Sunday. So I have this one that says later, and I need something else. And I just don't know what. I don't want to use a bullet. Like if I'm using this, I want to use something. Yeah, brave and bold. Can you see that? There you go. Not going to work. And then that's spring. All right, so, so far I've only used orange stickers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this over here that says busy day. It is a hexagon from colorful boxes. Did I put that on? The, I thought I put it over here. I don't know. I think I need to lay off the coffee a little bit. Um, so yeah, we're going to put busy day and then I'm going to just layer them together. So busy day and later, and they are both crooked. Perfect. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use, because I need I need to incorporate black. It's Halloween, black and orange, like I need to do that. So for Monday, for carving pumpkins, because I wanna make sure that like it's noted that we are not going anywhere on Monday because we've got, oh, but see now those are in line. Can I, I'm not even gonna try to get it up. I'm just going to use my undo and because like it's stacked so that's why I'm moving it I don't want them to be stacked on top of each other like that so even though it is an evening activity um so I, I try to keep this chronological from left to right but I mean you know whatever it doesn't always happen so yeah I just don't want it stacked on top of each other. I think the only thing, because we don't have library this week, they are closed for staff development day. Um, I don't really like them stacked over here. So, drop of undo. Undo is just something that I get from Michael's. Makes it easy for me to peel up the stickers. Some stickers, like depending on the paper that was used, does not come up as easy as others. Okay, this line. Okay, well, I can't put it all the way over there because now I don't have anywhere to write. So we'll stick this over here. I'm probably off camera. Oh no, I'm not. Okay, so those are staggered. So I like that better. I don't want to put a shopping list here. But I think that is everything I need to do. So the shopping list is going to end up going over here on Wednesday. And I am going to use a to buy and a black checklist. Oh, okay. Well, no, you know what? That works. Because what I can actually do is layer these together like that. And I think, where's my, there it is. I'm actually going to slice it now. I think I'm going to, because I don't want to cut it just in case I end up wanting to use it, I'm going to use a little undo, just a tiny bit, and peel up this corner and stick it underneath. There. That'll dry and that'll come down. Oh, I think that's really cute. All right, so I just don't want it to say weekly highlight and it's really pink and everything in this corner, but I was coming up empty on stickers that I could use from the sticker books I've been using. So I'm gonna come over here into the mini seasonal. There's just this black and white striped, nice and simple. So I'm gonna go with that. Um, I really don't know what I'm gonna do about those florals down the center. Cause I kind of, it's been like, I think three weeks in a row that I, oh no, I guess I didn't do it last week. I was going to say that I put washi down the center. I think I did it in my classic. Oh, and I had a trick-or-treat over here. That's all right. 
and that is all right um but now that's covered up so I feel much better Christmas oh my gosh almost but yeah I feel better now that that is covered up and I do want to bring in some deco I could have used the it's Halloween but like I didn't want to over here because like it's not Halloween over here it's Halloween over here and I used that one already so I think what I'm going to do I almost think yeah because like I haven't pulled anything off of this sheet from the mini so I'm going to instead find that page here in the classic one and use that to bring in some other deco. All right, well, I really don't know what else to do. Like, I'm kind of, this is kind of bothering me because it's completely empty, but I, I don't, I don't really have anything else that I can put in here. And I don't really want to force anything. Um, okay, I was trying to find this. This is the orange seasonal um, because now I am going to try to force it. <laughs> um, I just can't leave well enough alone, can I? Just see if there is anything over here that I could use. Kind of like the stargaze. Yeah, you know what? Let's just use that. So I will stick that over here. Cause like I said, the right side of the daily boxes are meant to signify evening. So we'll stick that there. I mean, it's kind of up in Friday. Yeah, let me actually scoot it down. I was trying to kind of make it, no, we'll just leave it. I'm done, I'm done. I'm walking away. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Um, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already so that you don't miss out on any of my other videos. Be sure to hit the bell icon if you want to be notified as soon as videos are uploaded because YouTube does not automatically notify you. And follow me on Instagram over there. I'm at Coffee Planner Mom and I will see you guys later.